So whether it's on a laptop with just one screen or a big multi-monitor setup, sometimes you just need to have everything new window at your fingertips on a single monitor. The new zone concept has got you covered. Let's take a look. Nuendo 8 introduces the zone concept to help streamline your workflow and allow even more efficient use of precious monitor space. The lower zone allows rapid navigation between the most critical functions while keeping your monitor neat and tidy. The default configuration now has separate tabs for the Mix Console, the Active Editor, and the all-new Sampler Track. The addition of the Mix Console tab means you'll no longer need to juggle the Project Window and the Mix Console. You can access the Mix Console's core functions from this tab. You have access to linking, panning, mute, solo, and listen. You can use the faders, of course, and the automation, track name, and track color. Across the top of the tab is the Mix Console toolbar. This toolbar provides direct access to filter and search tools, to the link settings, and to the channel width. You can also access the Functions menu here. And if you want to open the full Mix Console, you can do so with one click. The left-hand margin allows you to select three different views, faders, inserts, and sends. This lets you handle your most common routing needs from inside the Mix Console tab. And the Mix Console now supports dedicated undo-redo controls. This means you can experiment with confidence because the sequential undo function will let you step backwards through your changes to the original state of your project. The next tab is the editor and it allows you simultaneous access to the project window and the editor for whatever type of content you've selected. If I click on an audio waveform, the sample editor instantly appears. If I select a MIDI part, the MIDI editor appears. And the timelines can be linked to synchronize the cursor position automatically between the editor tab and the project window. You can record directly into the editors. And in addition to the toolbar across the top of the editor tab, you can now access the full host of editor controls and functions by changing the inspector from traditional track display to the new editor mode. And here again, as you switch between track types, the editor inspector automatically shifts to accommodate the new selection. And just like the Mix Console tab, you have the option to pop it out into a free-floating window at any time. You can rearrange the tabs by dragging and clicking. You can open up the lower zone setup window with the gear icon for even more control, including the ability to call up the chord pads tab previously only available with the Nuendo MEK. At the very bottom of the lower zone is the new Transport tab, which gives you all the tools of the transport panel in a convenient and out-of-the-way location. The gear icon in the corner lets you set up any configuration you want. Finally, we have one tab left here, the new Sampler Control tab. If we drag in a piece of audio, it opens and creates a brand new type of track called a sampler track. To see these two revolutionary new features in action, let's click over to the next video and get started. Nuendo 8, the new standard for audio to picture work.